Ladies and gentlemen, in case you haven't noticed, it is Thursday night. It's Thursday, and it's time for another episode of Impact Pro Wrestling. Last Sunday, we were in Las Vegas, but now we are here in Dayton, Ohio, and we've got another great show planned for everyone here and everyone watching at home. Ladies and gentlemen, it looks like uh, we're going to start off tonight with a, a nice little talk here with our Impact Pro Wrestling General Manager. Ladies and gentlemen, I welcome here to the ring. This is Danielle Gabriel. It appears that uh, Daniel has something to say here to the Impact Pro Wrestling fans in attendance. So we're going to see what that is right now. Ladies and gentlemen, huge news here. We are going to have two matches that will decide which man will go to our next pay-per-view power struggle to decide the number one contender for the Impact Pro Wrestling World Heavyweight Championship. It's going to be epic. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is our first match of the evening. We're about to get to this match, but I got to tell you about these matches we have planned for you tonight. This is match number one. It's going to be the golden one, Heath Gold, going up against Prince Morrison. We're going to see which one of these two men will come out victorious. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is our next match of the evening. We are going to see the famous one against the All-Star. It's going to be the All-Star, Johnny Star, against the famous one, Austin Famous. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is one of the huge matches just announced here by Daniel Gabriel. It's going to be a rematch of this past Sunday at Hell on Earth. It's going to be Justice the Wrestling Revolutionist against the dangerous one, Eddie Danger. Now, ladies and gentlemen, this is our actual main event. This is match number four, the final main event of the evening. Eddie Danger and Justice. That is a rematch that had an epic match on Hell on Earth this past Sunday, but Mr. Amazing and Peter Young, a rematch that has happened about two months ago at Golden Boy, the number one contender match. These men will go one-on-one -on -one once again for a shot at that number one contender slot. And this is our main event, but right now it is time for our first match of the evening. This is our main event. We have to build up to this matchup, but we have to build up with the first match of the evening, which is going to be Prince Morrison against Heath Gold. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it is time for our first matchup of the evening. And ladies and gentlemen, here comes one of the wrestlers that we need for our first matchup. Of course, we are missing his opponent. But ladies and gentlemen, for the moment, allow me to introduce to you. This is the golden one. This is Heath Gold.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, the golden one here is in the ring. We're going to see a great matchup here between this man. All right, and so that is Heath Gold in the ring. And now here comes the opponent. Ladies and gentlemen, here's his opponent. Here comes Prince Morrison. Found to be an excellent matchup between Prince and Heath. Uh, I don't know about anyone else, but personally, I think I'm uh, rooting here for, uh, for Prince Morrison. Interested to see what this royal man will be able to do in this matchup here. gentlemen we have Prince Morrison we have Heath Gold it is time for this matchup to begin all we need is the referee to ring the bell and there we go and this matchup has begun you can see Heath Gold starting off this matchup aggressively with that nice running arm drag but you can see Prince Morrison Slamming Heath Gold's face against that top turnbuckle. Heath Gold now fighting back against Prince. Got Prince in a lock here. Just dragging him to that corner and slamming his face up against that turnbuckle here. Real aggression right there shown by Heath Gold. Now Heath. Looks like he's going to hit that top rope. We're going to see some flying gold. Oh, and gold crashes hard. Pinfall right here by Prince. Heath Gold, though, able to kick out. Prince Morrison with that Irish whip, sending Heath Gold to the outside on the apron, and now sending him all the way to the floor. Oh, look at that. Now these guys going ham outside of the ring. Oh, God. Prince Morrison just slamming Heath Gold up against that barricade on the outside. He's been currently still outside receiving a four count from the referee. Oh, look at that. Heath Gold trying to slam Prince Morrison's face up against that turnbuckle, that ring post. Looks like it's not pliable though. Prince Morrison though slamming Heath Gold's face up against that ring post. But Heath Gold going to be able to come back, sending Prince Morrison back to the ring. Now getting in the ring himself. Overhand shot avoided by Prince Morrison and delivering a big elbow shot. Now here comes Prince Morrison with the snake eyes from the fireman carry position. Showing off some real strength right there. Prince Morrison with the pinfall here. But he's gold able to kick out. Great body splash right there by Prince Morrison, he's gold taking a lot of damage here. Now you can see Prince Morrison dealing some damage to that arm of Heath Gold. Just holding it there and delivering a huge knee strike. Overhand shot blocked by Heath Gold. He's trying to fight back, but the punches of Prince Morrison are coming in. And Prince delivers a nice back body drop. Now you can see Prince Morrison just raking his forearm against the face of Heath Gold. Now once again, Heath on one knee, Prince Morrison. Heath Gold trying to fight back, big shot to the gut, huge running forearm. Forearm got off, Prince Morrison on the outside trying to get back into the ring. But Heath, you can see him here, 
fighting off Prince Morrison, sending him all the way to the outside of the ring. Now it looks like Heath Gold can be in con full control here. Front Russian leg sweep right there. Oh, look at that. Huge move right there by Prince Morrison. I'm sorry, by Heath Gold. Looks like Prince Morrison is indeed trying to uh, gain the control once again. By putting Heath back to the ring and then delivering a huge boot right to the side of the head. Now Prince... Looks like, oh, look at that. Looks like Prince is going for something there, but he's just delivering a massive clothesline, almost basically out of nowhere. Now Heath Gold setting up Prince Morrison. He's got him in the Oklahoma Slam, and he's going to send him right into the middle turnbuckle. Pinfall right here by Heath Gold. Kick out right there by Prince Morrison. Now look at this. Looks like Heath Gold is measuring Prince. Oh, look at this. But Prince Morrison able to find his way out of it here. And delivering a huge Russian leg sweep. And then look at this. Looks like Prince Morrison measuring Heath Gold. The arms are locked, ladies and gentlemen. This is royalty. Butterfly pile driver, ladies and gentlemen. Pinfall, and I think we got it here. We have a one, we have a two, and we're gonna get a. Oh, we are not gonna get a three because Heath Gold able to kick out. He saw that hand in the air and he knew he was in trouble. He kicked out. I wouldn't blame him in the slightest if he just did that on instinct. Didn't know where he was or who he's in there with. All he knows is that he's in a match right now. Can't blame the man if he's disoriented in any way. Royalty, a devastating move, but somehow he's gold able to fight out of it. You can see Prince Morrison now trying to do some more damage here to Heath by applying this headlock here. Also regaining some stamina of his own. It looks like Heath has had enough. Trying to fight out with some nice strong shots. Nice snapmare of his own. And a nice lock of his own here. Got that arm all the way around the neck of Prince. But now Prince fighting out of it. Nice elbow shots of his own. And now Prince sending Heath into that corner. And setting up Heath. Top rope. Heath fighting back. Kicking away. Time to fly with the crossbody. Pinfall right here by Heath Gold. Prince Morrison, however, able to kick out at two. It looks like these men are going back and forth, ladies and gentlemen. As you can see Heath Gold fired up here, trying to get the fans on his side. Nice overhand shot right there by Heath Gold. Look at this Prince, nice reversal, sending Heath into that corner. Reverse, STO, into the middle turnbuckle. And Prince Morrison delivering a huge elbow drop right there on the chest of Heath Gold. Prince getting Heath on his feet. Oh, and look at that. Heath came right at him to his face. And Prince just delivered that Pele kick square on the face. That wasn't even on the mouth, that wasn't on the nose, that wasn't on the eyes. That just took up his whole face. The Pele kick was the setup here. We've seen it before. Oh, look at this. Kingmaker, Prince Maker, I don't even know. We just saw Prince Morrison steal the finishing move of Heath Gold. Disrespectful, if nothing else. And he won the match. With Heath Gold's finisher. It was a great match, but my god, what an ending, ladies and gentlemen. Here we see some of the great moves that we had throughout this matchup. Here we see Prince Morrison's finisher, the Butterfly Pile Driver. We call it Royalty. We see some great moves right here by Heath. Diving crossbody from the top rope set that up great. 
Unfortunately, not able to get three count off of that. The Pele kick right here, which we knew was the setup for the finish. I did not expect the finish that we got, though. Looks like we all just saw the Prince Maker right here by Prince Morrison really showing off his skill here in the ring and showing off some of that mm, royal sassiness. Let's call it that. Ladies and gentlemen, we just had one epic match. And it's time to move on to another match which I'm sure will be just as epic. Ladies and gentlemen, this is our next match of the evening. The famous one, Austin Famous, the all-star Johnny Star, are about to go head to head. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're here. We are back. It is time for our second match of the evening, and it's going to be this man, ladies and gentlemen. He calls himself the all-star of IPW. Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to introduce to you, this is Johnny Star. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here comes Johnny Star. I haven't seen Johnny Star on Impact Pro Wrestling for a while. You gotta believe that a lot of people here, including myself, are excited to see Johnny Star back on IPW. Hopefully his return to IPW will be added with a huge victory here over Austin Famous. We'll see exactly what kind of match this is for Johnny and what match this is for Austin. Now that's Johnny Star, ladies and gentlemen. Johnny Star in the ring, looking like an all-star as he normally does. But now, ladies and gentlemen, here comes his opponent, just basking in the famous light here. Ladies and gentlemen, here comes Austin Famous. You can see him obviously wearing the famous robe here. Austin Famous, uh, if you couldn't tell, uh, a little bit on the cockier side of the spectrum here with the robe and the mannerisms and generally his whole demeanor. But it has been said by plenty of men, much more cockier, much less cockier, just as cocky that it ain't cocky if you can back it up. We'll see tonight if Austin Famous can quote unquote back it up. Now we have Austin Famous in the ring. We also have Johnny Starr. Referee will ring the bell and this matchup will begin with Johnny Starr, double leg takedown, and the fist raining down immediately. A great way to start off this matchup between these two guys. Johnny Starr not gonna waste any time. Gonna show all these IPW fans exactly what he's made of as he delivers that great springboard moonsault. But Austin Famous not gonna let Johnny show him up as he reverses the fireman's carry. Austin Famous delivering a huge drop kick right there to Johnny Starr. Now getting Johnny on his feet. Irish whip into those ropes. Going for a move there, but Johnny able to avoid it, sending Austin into those ropes. Going for a kick, but Austin able to avoid it and turning it into a running S-T-O. Now Austin's famous in control here. Setting up Johnny against those ropes and sending him back around the center of the ring. Now Austin's famous measuring Johnny just so he can stomp right on the chest. Austin's famous going up to the top rope here. Oh, and look at that. Huge body splash right there on Johnny Star. That had to, like, hurt the neck of Johnny. He was seated. He wasn't even on his back or on his stomach. Overhand shot avoided right there by Johnny Star, but Johnny Star couldn't avoid that tilt to world slam that Austin Famous just delivered to him. You can see Austin Famous currently in control here. But it looks like that moment he took to play to the crowd may have cost him here. As Johnny Star does that Uranagi slam. But now you can see Famous. Nice shot to the gut. 
Johnny Star on Austin's shoulders. Now Johnny fighting back. Getting out of that Oklahoma slam here position. Now we can see Johnny Star slamming Austin Famous' face into that turnbuckle. Some real aggression right there shown by Johnny Star. Going for a move here, but Austin Famous. Huge reversal. Great DDT. Austin Famous just raking his forearm against the face of Johnny Star. Now Austin going for the pinfall here. Johnny Star, however, able to kick out. Great suplex right there performed by Austin Famous here. Now Austin setting up Johnny on the top rope. Johnny able to fight back here. Flying blockbuster from the top rope. A great move right there by Johnny. Johnny going for the pinfall immediately. But Austin Famous able to kick out. Johnny starts delivering a huge elbow shot right to the head of Austin Famous. And you can see Johnny Starr with that nice knee drop. Now look at this, Johnny Starr throwing. Austin Famous all the way to the outside of the ring. First on the apron, and the drop kick to the outside. Johnny not going to go out there and chase Austin Famous. Austin on his feet. Johnny's going to wait for him to get back to the ring himself. Now Austin sending Johnny to those ropes and delivering a nice clothesline. Both men go down. Pinfall right here. But Johnny Starr able to kick out. Oh, look at that. Austin delivering a huge kick right to the gut. Snake Eyes right there by Austin Famous. Austin Famous running completely raged here on Johnny Star. Johnny Star trying to fight him off, blowing off Austin Famous with his legs here. Going for a quick pinfall right here on Austin Famous. Austin Famous, of course, able to kick out. Now Johnny Star looks like he's maybe taking control here. As he applies the shoulder claw, or wait, maybe not. Austin Famous now fighting back from it with some big shots. Great spine buster right there by Austin Famous. Pinfall right here by Austin. One. And you can see Johnny Star able to kick out at one. Now Austin getting Johnny on his feet. He's got one arm locked, and here comes that backstabber, ladies and gentlemen. Pinfall attempt right here by Austin Famous. Johnny Stark able to kick out at two. Now look at this, ladies and gentlemen. Austin Famous trying to measure Johnny Starr. Going for the fame and fortune, but looks like it didn't connect properly. But did he get enough out of it? I don't think I don't think he thinks he's got so. And he continues his assault right here on Johnny Starr. Oh, look at this. Austin going for a headbutt, but Johnny able to avoid it. Oh, look at that. Going for a move there, but Austin Famous able to avoid it, turning it into a huge clothesline. Austin with that nice spinning leg drop. Pinfall right here by Austin Famous. He's got one. That's two. Johnny Star still able to kick out. A resilient man, Johnny Star. Right? We can, we've just seen Austin Famous... Just run completely raged over Johnny Star here tonight. Well, Austin Famous just sending Johnny Star back to the center of the ring here. Now, single knee backbreaker from the fireman's carry position. A great move right there by Austin Famous. Johnny Star trying to avoid whatever Austin's got to dish out, but Austin staying right on top of Johnny Star. 
Going for a clothesline, but Johnny Star able to avoid it. Sending Austin Famous to the outside of the ring. Now Johnny Star inside the ring trying to recover here. He's going to wait though. Not going to go after Austin. Got to respect this. Well, he is going after him now. Looks like he took some time to recover on the inside of the ring before he went outside to deliver that Hurricane Rana. Now, it finally looks like Johnny Star may be getting the advantage here. Getting some offense here. Here comes Johnny Star. Just slamming Austin Famous' his entire body right on the apron. Austin Famous now sending Johnny back into the ring. Going for a stomp there, but you can see that. Oh, look at this. Johnny, nice reversal, reversing Austin Famous to the attempt at a flat liner. Oh, look at this. Here comes Johnny with a great maneuver right there. Those arms were lucky. Hit him with that great version of a neck breaker. I, can't, I don't even know how to describe that. A gory bomb neck breaker, possibly? Johnny Star going for the pinfall right here on Austin Famous. Austin, though, able to kick out. Ladies and gentlemen, I think it is time that we all witness something epic. That we all witness an exploding star. The finishing move right there by Johnny Star. He's got the leg lock pinfall attempt here. That's one, that's two. But that's not three, ladies and gentlemen, as Austin Famous was able to kick out. But Johnny Star not going to let that take him down. Not going to let him argue with the ref too much as he gets right back on Austin Famous. Nice forearm right there. Now Johnny delivering some hard punches to the face. Johnny Star going up to the second rope here. But he wants Austin on his feet so he can deliver that nice second row Hurricane Rana. Johnny Starr now setting up Austin Famous on those ropes so he can blow Austin back to the center of the ring. Pinfall right here by Johnny Starr. Austin Famous still able to kick out. Johnny Star applying that shoulder claw here. He picked them up just to put them right back down with the snap mare. Now you can see Johnny Star just locking those legs around the torso of Austin Famous and really applying some pressure here. Now Johnny let him go. Looks like the damage has been dealt. Pinfall right here. Off the famous though, able to get the kick out. Early parts of this matchup, it was all Austin Famous, all the aggression, all the damage being dealt by Austin, but now it looks like middle to ending part of this matchup. It's all Johnny. Off the famous though, trying to get his way. And look at that right there. Fame and fortune out of nowhere. Oh, but look at that. Fame and fortune doesn't mean anything. As Johnny Star able to kick out at two. Austin Famous going up to the second rope here. Great front drop kick right there by Austin Famous. It seems like tonight everybody here in IPW is really showing off every skill they have in the book. Johnny Star, Austin Famous, Heath Gold, and Prince Morrison, all these men showing off excellent skills. These guys completely detailed and completely upgraded players in the game. I can't wait to see what Justice, Eddie Danger, Mr. Amazing, and Peter Young are going to show us all here tonight. Look at that right there, ladies and gentlemen. Johnny Stark in control here, just slamming Austin Famous' face right into that mat. Now look at this, Johnny Star setting up Austin Famous. Powerbomb position. 
Alley you into the snake eyes from the power bump position, ladies and gentlemen. Now Johnny starts setting up for the single leg guillotine. Johnny Star taking complete advantage here, taking complete control, taking nothing for granted as he just continues to deal every kind of damage to Austin Famous move after move after move and it looks like that move is the ending of the matchup ladies and gentlemen a great matchup here by Johnny a great matchup here by Austin but in the end Johnny just came away with a victory in an epic way we saw the exploding star we saw fame and fortune but it looks like the exploding star the all-star was just too much for the famous one tonight, ladies and gentlemen. A great match here, regardless. Great moves performed throughout this entire matchup. Leg drops and clotheslines, backbreakers, brain busters, uh, front flipping slams. But in the end, it was all a gory neck breaker that ended this matchup. Right here, you see it. The move that ended this matchup. I mean, here is your winner. Of course, it is Johnny Star. Austin the Famous still in the ring trying to get up. Look at this. Going for a clothesline, but Johnny Star had it scouted. Dodged it. Punches reigning in a clothesline of his own. Sending Austin Famous to the outside. Looks like Johnny Star has had one heck of a match here on IPW and one heck of a finish. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for our third matchup of the evening. Eddie Danger against Justice. This is the rematch from the match that we saw this past Sunday at Hell on Earth. But this match has a lot higher stipulations here. We'll see which one of these two men can come away with the victory. The wrestling revolutionist or the dangerous one. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time for our third match of the evening. It will be this man. This is the Wrestling Revolutionist. This is Justice. And he'll be going one-on-one -on -one here tonight against Eddie Danger. A rematch from the great match that we saw this past Sunday at Hell on Earth. But this match has some much higher stipulations, of course, those stipulations, those stipulations being that the winner of this match will go on in four weeks to face the winner of our next match, Peter Young and Mr. Amazing, to become the number one contender for the Impact Pro Wrestling World Heavyweight Championship. And you gotta believe that both of these men do deserve some championship recognition. Justice deserves it. Eddie Danger deserves it. But we're gonna see which one of these two men is willing to fight hard enough to get it now that's justice in the ring and here comes Eddie danger ladies and jets ED on that shirt and you can see on the back danger zone because you know Eddie danger is prepared and he is has this idea in his mind that he's gonna welcome justice into the danger zone here tonight we'll see if he can accomplish that ladies and gentlemen this is bound to be a great matchup between both of these great, great wrestlers here. Ladies and gentlemen, that is Eddie Danger. We have Justice in the ring. It is about time that this matchup does indeed get started here. It's going to be the dangerous one versus the wrestling revolutionist. Now that's Justice. And that is Eddie Danger. The referee will ring the bell in this matchup. Will begin. It's going to begin with Justice delivering a nice fisherman suplex. And a great knee to the back here. You gotta believe this man definitely do have some chemistry in the ring after the match we saw Sunday. It's gonna be interesting to see how these two men will go off of each other here. Great knee right there by Justice. 
Here comes Justice with another Fisherman Suplex. Great elbow drop right there by Justice. Now, just as you can see, I'm just raking the face of Eddie Danger. Eddie Danger, great reversal. Nice reverse DDT here. Eddie getting Justice on his feet. Headlock position here. And Eddie Danger delivering a nice elbow to the back of the head. Now Eddie sending Justice to the outside of the ring, first on the apron, but now all the way to the outside. Shutting up Justice on one on one knee here, but Justice able to fight back with a big punch of the gut and then a nice back suplex. Now Justice attacking Eddie Danger, slamming his face right into that mat on the outside. Referee currently out of five companies, man. We've got to get back into the ring. Justice sending an injury into that barricade, but you can see Eddie trying to fight back here. Now Justice sending them both back into the ring. Middle rope here. Justice looking for some kind of maneuver. Nice double lap handle from the second rope. Looks like Justice has finally met his momentum's end at the hands of Eddie Danger. Both arms locked for that Northern Light suplex here. Now Eddie Danger taking control with that nice snapmare. Justice with a great reversal there, elbow to the head. Now Justice delivering some strong strikes to Eddie Danger. And you can see Justice here. Delivering a nice leg drop to the arm of Eddie Danger. Eddie Danger with a great reversal. Nice shoulder block there. Nice move right there by Eddie Danger attacking the arm of Justice. Dragging Justice over into that corner to slam his face into that turnbuckle again and again and again and again and again. Justice able to roll out of this, but Eddie Danger still taking control here. And Eddie Danger going to send Justice flying back into the center of the ring. Pinfall right here by Eddie Danger, but Justice able to kick out. Now, Eddie getting his honestly justice. Irish whip. Oh, look at this. Going for a move here, but Eddie Danger able to avoid it. Back suplex. Justice able to avoid that himself. And here comes Justice. Nice leg drop after those ropes. Another nice leg drop. Justice getting on his feet here and delivering a great backstabber. Oh, look at that nice hesitation drop kick right there by Justice. Going for something else here, but Eddie Danger able to reverse with a back body drop reversal. Big kick, but Justice showing off the toughness, just shrugging off like it's nothing. Big elbow shot right to the face. Now Justice got Eddie Danger in the fireman's carry position, slamming his head up against that turnbuckle and just letting him loose. Not even his head, ladies and gentlemen, my apologies. That was like the back of the neck. Now Justice slowing down the pace here a little bit, just stomping right on the stomach right there of, of Eddie Danger, stomping right on the stomach, doing some minor damage here. Justice taking the pace a little bit slower. Now he heated it up for a minute, and now he's pulling it back. Not really sure here which, uh, which one of these two men really benefits from having a slow pace or a fast pace. Looks like both of these men kind of have the same pace when it comes to a wrestling match. Not necessarily a slow pace, but not really a fast one either. Both these men keeping it very medium pace. Oh, look at that. Once again, Justice going for a move here. But Eddie Danger able to reverse here. Now it looks like Eddie Danger able to take control. Snake Eyes on Justice.
Eddie Danger going for the pinfall right here on Justice. He's got one, but you can see Justice able to kick out. And you see that look on Eddie Danger's face. He knows he's got to do more than that. Great elbow drop right there by Eddie Danger. You can see the height he got on that. Now it looks like Eddie Danger, he has something else planned in mind with that great move right there. Torture, rack, back, stabba. And it looks like Justice has just been welcome to the Danger Zone. Pinfall right here by Eddie Danger. One, two. But Justice able to kick out, able to get that shoulder up. Looks like Eddie Danger, although the finishing move, that corkscrew elbow drop didn't work. Looks like he has indeed gaining control, if only for a moment here. As Justice now takes control with this snap. D D T. Now Justice getting Eddie on his feet so he can jump and deliver that great DDT. Now here comes Justice with that great knee drop. You can see him wind back that knee to deliver it right to the face of Eddie Danger. And you can see that knee drop was all that was needed to knock out Eddie Danger. A great match here performed by both of these men and a worthy series. A worthy sequel here after the great match they had at Hell on Earth. Congratulations to Justice as Justice will be facing the winner of our next matchup. Mr. Amazing or Peter Young here. It's going to be a great match here and Justice really showing off his athletic ability here. Eddie Danger, he put on one hell of a match. But in the end, it was this right here. It was that knee drop, wind it up, and bam! Right on the face. You can see Eddie Danger really showing off how much that hurt. Because that knee definitely hurt. You see that knee of justice, just a devastating maneuver. This was our third match, ladies and gentlemen. And now it's time for our fourth match of the evening. It's going to be Mr. Amazing, and it's going to be Peter Young. It's time for our main event, match number four, ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen, it is now time for our final match of the evening. It will be this match right here. It will be Mr. Amazing going one-on-one -on -one with Peter Young. The winner of this match will go on in four weeks to face Justice. At our upcoming pay-per-view power struggle. And the winner of that match, of course, will be decided to be the number one contender for the Impact Pro Wrestling World Heavyweight Championship. Now, let's find out right now which one of these two men is going to have to go one-on-one -on -one with Justice. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Let's get this show on the road here, ladies and gentlemen. It is time for Peter Young and Mr. Amazing. And uh, that, that's not Peter Young or Mr. Amazing. Ladies and gentlemen, this right here is DJ Summers. Now, he's not scheduled to have a match on it, as you can probably tell by his attire. But it looks like he uh, is going to come out here and have some words with the Impact Pro Wrestling fans in attendance. Of course, DJ Summers, the number one contender for the Impact Pro Wrestling Television Championship. He will be going one-on-one -on -one with Jackson Wright in four weeks at Power Struggle as well. That is the championship match at Power Struggle. Looks like a DJ Summers is going to come out here and address that situation that he found himself in, that he put himself in, I should say, in four weeks. Of course... Uh, this past Sunday night, he did beat Jack Smith to gain that slot in what was truly an amazing matchup. Let's see what we're going to see DJ Summers say about that here, ladies and gentlemen.
Ladies and gentlemen, looks like DJ Simmons has made his intentions here perfectly clear to everyone here. And Jack said, right, DJ Summers is coming for that Impact Pro Wrestling Television Championship. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for our main event of the evening. It is time for this man to go one-on-one -on -one with Peter Young. It's time for Peter Young to go one-on-one -on -one with this man, Mr. Amazing. Now, you may remember this match from a while ago. We had this matchup two months ago on the pay-per-view known as Golden Boy. Mr. Amazing and Peter Young, the winner of that match back at Golden Boy, got the opportunity to go one-on-one -on -one with Beast for the IPW World Heavyweight Championship. Of course, Peter Young won that match and he got that opportunity at Hell on Earth this past Sunday. Although, unfortunately, the opportunity did not work out for him. But now he's getting one more opportunity. He's got to run through the man that he already beat once, Mr. Amazing. But Mr. Amazing, just like Peter Young, getting another opportunity here. He's just got to run through the man who beat him. I got to tell you, back at Golden Boy, I don't think uh, Mr. Amazing really had it in him back then. But over the months that he's been here in IPW, really putting pedal to the metal so to speak really doing what he's got to do here really showing off all the skill that he's acquired in his wrestling career I think he's got exactly what it takes a to beat this man right here Peter Young B to beat justice in four weeks Sunday at power struggle and C to beat beast to become the impact pro wrestling world heavyweight champion You can see Peter Young coming down here with some new gear, maybe a new gear, a new lifestyle, a new perspective. We'll see what Peter Young will be able to do here in this matchup against Mr. Amazing. Of course, ladies and gentlemen, this is the phenomenal one. This is Peter Young. This is guaranteed to be a great match, ladies and gentlemen. This is main event worthy. You best believe that. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this matchup has begun here. Mr. Amazing and Peter Young. Peter Young starting off this matchup in the chain wrestling, but Mr. Amazing able to escape going to the back of Peter Young. Peter Young able to escape, turning that into a nice snap mare, now wrenching on the neck. Quick three wrenches doing some damage to Mr. Amazing. Now it looks like Peter Young done with this move here, gonna deliver a big knee to the back. And another big knee, comboed with a Russian leg sweep. But you can see Mr. Amazing with nice reversal arm drag style. Nice overhand shot. The grapple here. More chain wrestling here by Mr. Amazing and Peter Young. But Peter Young really winning in this chain grappling setup. As he really puts some hurt on that arm of Mr. Amazing. Now Mr. Amazing being sent into those ropes. Clothesline attempt right there by the phenomenal one. Looks like he couldn't get all of it though. But he got enough of it. Peter Young getting amazing on his feet, turning him around, and a big slam right there by Peter Young. Big knee to the back right there. Back of that neck has got to be in pain. Now we can see Peter Young measuring springboard crossbody. Great move right there. By the phenomenal one. Pin floor right here by Peter. He's got one, but Mr. Amazing able to kick out. Almost the exact second that hand hit the mat for one. Now, Mr. Amazing trying to fight back. Big elbow into the gut. Big running bulldog. Now, 
Now Mr. Amazing trying to fight back here, delivering some strong strikes here to the Phenomenal One. Nice snap man right there. Going for a headbutt, but Peter Young had it scouted, delivering a big elbow to the head. Mr. Amazing has reversal of his own. Now Mr. Amazing setting up here for a great gourd buster. You can see Peter Young Days trying to get in that corner. Mr. Amazing gonna just jump right on him, sitting him up, facing him. And now getting him up so he can deliver this suplex. Mr. Amazing gonna hit those ropes so he can deliver the great elbow drop. Mr. Amazing just slamming the head of Peter Young up against that mat. And here comes Mr. Amazing with that nice neck breaker. You can see one thing in Mr. Amazing's game plan here that I don't think you saw before, and that is the aggression. He is not taking his time with Peter Young. He is going move after move after move, exactly what he needs to be doing. Second rope blockbuster right there by the Phenomenal One. Pinfall right here by Peter. Mr. Amazing still able to kick out. I think that was actually before the one count. Kick dodged by Mr. Amazing. Going for a move here. And he gets it off with a great back suplex. You can see Mr. Amazing setting up Peter Young on those ropes. And you can see Mr. Amazing delivering some clubbing blows to the chest of Peter Young. And a big shot just to the side of the head. Mr. Amazing going for a slam here, but Peter Young able to reverse it, turning it into a reverse DDT. Now, Mr. Amazing showing off some athleticism and some agility as he delivers that great springboard moonsault. But Mr. Amazing not one to be fond of the agility as he just gets right back on. Peter Young with a big punch to the side and then a running bulldog. Pinfall right there by Mr. Amazing. Peter Young able to kick out, however. Irish whip, Mr. Amazing into those ropes. Looks like Peter Young was going for that clothesline, although it looks like he did not get all of it. You can see Peter Young playing to the crowd here, trying to get the crowd on his side. Irish whipping, Mr. Amazing all the way to the outside of the ring. And then look at this. Looks like Peter Young has got something in mind here. Oh, look, he's got nothing in mind. He was just playing a little gag on Mr. Amazing and all of us here in attendance. Nice fist drop right there by Peter Young. Now Peter going up to the top rope. So he can dive all the way to the outside with that great leg drop. Now Mr. Amazing trying to find a way to fight back here. Delivering a great flat liner. Now, Mr. Amazing with some clubbing blows right to the face. You can see this right now, ladies and gentlemen. Mr. Amazing putting Peter Young back into the ring, but now bringing him out for a whiplash neck breaker. I apologize for that, ladies and gentlemen. I uh, kind of cringed there because you know that move does some serious damage. Looks like Mr. Amazing going for it one more time. Yes, he does. God, Mr. Amazing just has so much twerk on that neck breaker. I know it is called a whiplash neck breaker, but God, it looks devastating. Shot blocked by Mr. Amazing, setting up Peter Young for the Fisherman neck breaker. Pinfall right here. He's got one, that's two. And that's three, ladies and gentlemen. I gotta say, I'm really surprised here tonight. We didn't see the revolution 
from Justice. We didn't see Born Amazing from Mr. Amazing. These guys don't even need their finishers to end these matches. They're just doing it with raw skill and raw power. It's going to be one heck of a contest when they go head to head in four weeks. Mr. Amazing versus Justice, number one contender match. It has been booked. No respect at all. Not being shown here to Peter Young. He put on one heck of a contest. Tons of respect. But you got to give a whole lot of love to Mr. Amazing. He just conquered the demon that he's been having with him since hell on earth. The demon that that is Peter Young's victory over him. Here we see the impact right here and the one, two, three that gave Mr. Amazing the victory. Ladies and gentlemen, here is your winner, Mr. Amazing. And you can see Mr. Amazing trying to take a look at Peter Young. And Peter Young just delivering a huge blow right to the face of Mr. Amazing. Peter Young not happy with the outcome of this matchup and taking it out on Mr. Amazing. That's just disrespectful of anything else here.